Nashburg, we're here. We're right here at Nashburg, guys, in Automobile Alley. I'm excited to pop in there, try some of their spicy chicken. I peeked my head in earlier and my beard fell off. Super spicy. I can't wait to try it and put this chicken sandwich controversy to bed. That was some delicious Anthem beers. Who could ask for a better afternoon? Toot toot. Ladies and gents, we're down here at Nashburn in Automobile Alley with Mark. Room. And he's gonna explain some of these lovely hot dishes. Yeah, so I'm excited to learn about uh, what we got here in front of us. Well, you're probably gonna be more excited once you start eating. All right, so sure. to take you through that, these are basically our top sellers. The two top sellers in the restaurant are the chicken dinner basket, and that's probably just likely due to the fact that chicken tenders are pretty popular everywhere else. Sure. Uh, but you get three jumbo tenders plus two sides and then you get to pick your heat. So you can go from mild to all the way to crazy hot, which Ooh. you'll have later. Second top seller in the mix is the hot chicken sandwich. That's a little bit bigger chicken sandwich than you might get at like at a drive-thru. Sure. Um, but it's got lemon mayo, pickles, and then a really vinegary slaw. Nice. And so you get that counterbalance of all the heat plus all the vinegary mm -hmm. stuff. Then we have our house-made buttermilk chicken biscuit. We only have a certain amount of these available per day. Oh, wow. Um, so we sell out fairly regularly. Uh, kind of on purpose because biscuits are only good for a certain amount of time. Yeah, right. and we didn't want to have a, put one of the side for. Yeah, us. we didn't want to have a frozen product. So these are these are a, a pretty top seller. And then this is a new addition to the menu. It's hot chicken tacos. Mm. So it's a little bit again of the lemon mayo with chicken and the vinegary coleslaw and a little bit of cheese. And so what we're trying to do is honor the, honor what hot chicken is in terms of we also have baskets with bone-in chicken. Okay. But then we also wanted to serve it a few different ways to make it a little more interesting. So right. when you get tired of eating a chicken drumstick. You can come get a chicken biscuit or a chicken taco or a chicken sandwich. Awesome. awesome. This is all like so. And then, yeah. this is and then you've got, of, yeah, different sides. So mac and cheese. Uh -huh. So it's just a basic American and cheddar mac and cheese. Okay. And Sweet. then we have pickled cucumbers and onions with watermelon, mm. coleslaw, potato salad, french fries. We also have onion rings too. And these look like those double fried french yeah, fries. Yeah, crispy. So, so crispy delicious. Ones. Oh, I can't wait. Sweet. I cannot wait to dig in. Yeah, right, you guys excited. <laughs> So where should we get started here? There's just so much to choose. Do we want to save maybe the spicy for last or do we want to go ahead and get that out of the way first? What are you thinking here? I mean, let, let's start with like the, the mild strip. Okay. And see how that And then goes. work our way up to yeah, the yeah, spicy. Yeah. Okay. So let's, uh, let's do that. Oh all right. yeah, that looks beautiful. Yeah. Oh, it's all smoky. Dang. Yeah, delicious crispy breading. and. This is just the mild guys, and it's already like I can taste. Like, it's got a little kick to it. More spice than a normal mild, <laughs> so we're in for Woo. a treat. Yeah, you guys are in for a treat. You're gonna watch us cry like babies. Like babies. Like little babies. There's so much variety right in front of my face. I know. I, I love chicken to to start with, and now we have you know like four or five different iterations here. You yeah. chop this time. Okay, I'll chop. I was on chopping duty last time. Chicken smooch. Chicken smooch. This one like kind of creeps up on you a little bit. Oh no, because I thought it was fine. <laughs> All right, I'm getting hotter, I'm getting hotter. All right, well, you want to just go go for it? Just go for the hottest. All right. I'm feeling, I'm feeling cocky, so. Well, I think that's about to change. Pun intended, because it's chicken. Oh. <laughs> Crazy hot. All right, here we go. Going for it. Yep, yep. It's going to be hot. It's still so good though. Yeah. Oh. It's got that, it's where that. It's a ramper. That pepper just dominates. Like, eh. Yeah. Like, eh. It is extremely tasty though. 
Oh my God. Yeah, it's absolutely delicious. There's a good balance. It's not just like- It's not just like, like slap you in the face yeah. hot. When we tried the da bomb, flashback to da bomb hot sauce. That was a bad idea. Cream. Oh, yeah, we're switch hitting these here. The Manfredi. We always switch hitting. It's like a cream circle. Yeah, we're switch hitting these biscuits here. The Manfredi. We always switch hitting. It's like a cream circle. Ooh, all right, let's move on to um, some of this watermelon cucumber salad. Yeah, that I sounds want to cool refreshing. Down that sounds refreshing. I'm gonna use my hot chicken fork though, because okay. I'm a man. I'm just gonna use my fingers like a man. Or a lady, I don't know. Anybody can use their fingers. <laughs> But, but this salad's perfect for cooling you down. I kind of slid some of that seasoning down the back of my throat a little bit. You breathe it in. <gasps> All right, you want to jump onto these tacos Let's here? Let's do that. They look you got this fantastic. delicious slaw on top of them. Yep. Yep. Got some cheese in there. Got some, some cheese chicken. in there. Che cheese and chicken. Everybody loves a good taco. A lot of good flavors in there. That yeah. coleslaw. Yeah, yeah. It does I'm have excited that about nice. the coleslaw being on the chicken sandwich as well. Mm -hmm. I love that. <laughs> I gotta say, the middle chicken, the hot dang, it's like the perfect that's, amount of spice. That's where you want to stay? Yeah. You don't want to move down the block to uh, getting your face melted? We're yep. moving on to this biscuit. Yeah, absolutely. You ready? Yeah. Tink it. Boink. Buttery, flaky. Just crumbling inside your mouth. Yum, 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 yum. That's not like a, a Subway bread that you gotta fight with your teeth. <laughs> I'm gonna try this with a little bit of this honey sauce here. You want some? Sure, give me a little dabber. Mm. Golden honey. You know what goes great with golden honey? What's that? Golden one from Anthem. It's delicious. You should have one. You know, on the police shows when they put a blanket on you after you've been through a traumatic experience mm -hmm. and your mouth's on fire for a little bit, sometimes you just need a nice, comfortable food blanket. Take note, police. When you're trying to comfort people, make sure you get them one of these chicken biscuits. Don't give them a blanket, give them a biscuit. So here, have something to snack on while you're waiting for your belongings to not be on fire. Got some crumblies on there. Got some crumblies. Got, got some, some cheese. Mac and cheese with some cheddar in it. Yeah. I do love a traditional macaroni and cheese. Some places will try to fancy it up and make it crazy and... Let's put eight pounds of lobster in it. <laughs> yep. Why don't you just make me some mac and cheese? Some mac and cheese, yeah. We're adults, kinda. Man, that is just everything so far. Oh man, so good. Definitely, you gotta get it down here to Nashford. It'll spice you up. It'll spice you up, but man, everything since then has just been cooling us down and yep. making our belly smile. I'm having a nice time. Anthem has uh, created this delicious masterpiece of beer. It's their cerveza style beer, the Red Ombre. Mm. Yum, 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 yum. It's got the Kiefer Sutherland's lime leaves are added for your citrus summertime flavors. I give this beer three, three smooches. smooches. Double fried, super crunchy, mm. delicious. Yeah. These are my favorite Delicious fries. better. I'm gonna do this. Fries are delicious, but it's yeah. time to get to ending this chicken sandwich debate. Everybody's in, is it Chick-fil-A? Is it Popeyes? It's Nashburg. Yeah. And I'm gonna prove it right now with my best friend, God. I'm gonna help. Brioche bun. Brioche. Got their signature chicken spices like in there. It Got smells the coleslaw. absolutely delicious. I can't wait. Are you ready to put this thing to rest? Dude, I am ready. ready I'm to, ready are to, you ready to tell the internet to hush? Yeah, I am ready to, too. to do that. Let's do it. I think we can lay all the internet kerfuffle to rest. Hush. Hush memes. Because this is how you do a chicken sandwich. Mm. I didn't want that bite to end, honestly. I was, I'm kind of upset that I have to take another That's piece of this away. No. Yeah. Hands down, best chicken sandwich I've ever had. It's a good day. If you want to have a good day, you know where to come. Nashburg. One Northwest 9th Street. Well, he said that. We did a little bit of a little bit of work here. We did a little bit. All right, we want to thank Nashburg for having us out. We want to thank Anthem Beers for putting all this stuff on. Woo! And we want to thank Mark, especially for having us out and explaining all these dishes. And uh, Catch us on the next one, folks. Oh, God.
Oklahoma. There's so much food to eat in Oklahoma.